Welcome to Collecting Chaos and part two of an introduction to erasers. And look who is no longer AWOL. He came back. Mr. Pen came back. Use this to brush off your work area before you uh, use your comic. Sorry if I did that too fast. Use it to brush off your work area um, and other things. Like I said, this is part two. Uh, let's get started. Okay, I've been working on the back of this comic and using the white eraser, as you can see. And uh, But that's not what this video is going to be about. It's not about using the white eraser, but I did want to show you something about it. See, I got it dirty again. And uh, before I told you that some people use an emery board, I've been using a piece of cardboard for years. And I got to thinking about it, and why am I doing that? I've got tons of this stuff around. This is 220 grit sandpaper. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to, one, two, three, four, and one for the end. And look how clean that got it. I mean, that's ready to go, ready to use again. Sandpaper, it's cheap. Get some. But that's not what we're going to work on. Let me uh, turn this back over to the front. I've got a board inside of it already. I'm going to take and show you how I use this eraser today. This is an art gum eraser and uh, I use it for cleaning the non-white areas of the comic when I'm dry cleaning them. And this is what I do. I take a piece of sandpaper. This is 100 grit. You can use 60 grit. You can use 40 grit. You can use 20 grit if you want. But I like 60 grit because it gives me a nice size. And all I'm going to do is run the eraser over it, like that, get some crumbles on there, dump them on the comic, grab a clean white cotton round, and then start going over the comic with it. You could use a uh, microfiber cloth for this. Probably use a washcloth if you wanted to, a terry cloth if you wanted to. I wouldn't, but you probably could. And let's see what kind of dirt we get off of this. Not a whole lot, but then this is my second take. I messed up the first one. Yeah, I messed up the good one for the first one really good. We got a little dirt off of it. Use your brush to brush all of that off. And now you could, if you wanted, brush it off the table onto the back of your sandpaper and reuse it. But I don't. I just... I'm not going to reuse it. And that's all there is to it. Nice, easy to do. That's the second thing I do with erasers. There you go. Get yourself some sandpaper. Get yourself some 200, 220, 1000 grit, whatever you happen to do. Get yourself a little pack of assorted sandpaper so that you have a lot of different types and sizes that you can use. Uh, don't use the sandpaper on the comic. I did that once just to show you what would happen. Braided a corner real good. And uh, We'll see you next video, but don't forget that I do drop videos three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and they have a live stream on Thursday. These are specials. These are extras. These are in addition to those. Uh, I'm also, uh, you can also watch me on uh, Patrick Murphy's channel on Sunday nights and on uh, Wednesday nights. Check us, check it out. We have a lot of fun. We we just we geek out is basically what we do. We like the chat to get uh, involved, and uh, we have a lot of fun on those channel, on those shows. Same thing with my Thursday night show. We just have a lot of fun. And then Friday night, we have more fun, but we also try to make a little money and sell stuff 
on Horizon Picks uh, blowout auction on Friday evening. That's at 10 o'clock Eastern on Friday evening. Don't want to miss that. You can get the addresses for Patrick Murphy uh, channel, Horizon Picks channel, my channel. Uh, well, you're obviously you know the one for my channel. Um, let's see. Uh, Darth Gojira's channel and uh, Diecast Comics channel. All of them are in the description below, along with my Patreon. And, uh, you know, if you want to support my channel through Patreon, you can. And not only is my Patreon down there, but also, if you are so inclined, you can buy me a cup of coffee. Yeah, it's all good. Go to my Patreon. Even if you don't want to subscribe, go to my Patreon. There's some free stuff on there for you. And uh, we'll see you next video. Bye.